Assad, North Korea, Iran developing nuclear reactor, Syria opposition member claims. A former Syrian member of parliament and current member of the Syrian opposition has claimed that Iran and North Korea are helping the Syrian regime to develop a nuclear reactor, according to the Saudi newspaper Okaz. Mohamed Barmo, who is part of the Syrian opposition in the north of the country, reportedly said that the Syrian regime of Bashar al-Assad is working on a project to construct a nuclear reactor in the Al-Gab plain in northwest Syria, with assistance from its allies Iran and North Korea. Barmo's claim is the latest out of numerous others in previous years, which also alleged that Tehran and Pyongyang are attempting to help Damascus develop nuclear capabilities. In 2018, the London-based Arabic-language news site, Al-Quds al-Arabi cited another source in the Syrian opposition as saying that the Syrian government was building a reactor near al quzair close to the Lebanese border. Uranium rods were reportedly transferred to an underground facility in the area. Three years earlier, the German newspaper Der Spiegel also reported that Western intelligence agencies had discovered that the Syrian regime was storing 8,000 fuel rods in a secret underground facility which connects with the nearby Zaida Lake, through a deep well. According to that report, such a practice was not necessary for a general weapons cache, but perfectly suited the requirements for a nuclear facility. Those reports stipulated that the facility was likely being used as the site and method to salvage the nuclear weapons program which was being worked on at the Alcabar reactor in the eastern province of Deir Ezzer. That reactor, which was built by the North Koreans, was destroyed by a strike in the Israeli operation to end the program in 2007.